Hey y'all, welcome back to Happily Hester After. So, funny thing, I was editing our uh, egg retrieval video and I ran across this clip that I completely forgot about of our last cetratide dose. So, I wanted to share with you guys because somehow, I don't know what happened, our last shot period, our trigger video got lost. I don't know what happened. In all honesty, you guys, we had to do the trigger in the parking lot at AMC so I'm not really surprised that it's now missing <laughs> but I figure you know this is technically our last recorded shot for this IVF cycle so I wanted to share it with you guys um, there is a little bit of a catch to the video but we'll talk about that after you watch this little clip so it's like three minutes go ahead and watch that and then we'll talk about what happens at the end okay guys good morning I'm tired. It's 5.35. This is the last Centratide. If you guys remember what Centratide is, this is what's supposed to stop my wife from ovulating. And this is the last one. Here we go. I hate it when you. I'm gonna clean it with you. I'm gonna take it out. Mm -hmm. I'm just gonna keep this one. Yeah. So, that's it, guys. We went through Gondolaf and we went through Centratide. That's it. We are done the stimulation medication and the ovulating suppression medication the last medication we got to do is and I'm gonna pull it out now because I don't want to be in a rush later I'm trying to do this This is called the trigger shot. What was the medicine before this one? The ovarian? Ovarian? We took 10 gummies. No. What's the medication before this trigger shot? We bought it already. It's Lupra? No, before this one. Overdrug? I think it's called that. Anyway. So we originally bought a completely different medication for her. Stimulation. They called us and was like, yo, hey. I'm like, that Lupra was the beautiful thing that was till after it happened. Yeah, also her her estrogen levels ended up being pretty elevated. And the overdrill, if that's what it's called, would have elevated her estrogen levels even more to the point of something called hyperstimulation, which could be very dangerous. So Lupron apparently, which is what this is, does not cause that. Um, and so the medication uh, for you guys' eyes only. Looks like this. This is what the medication looks like. It's just a small tube, small vial, small needle. And it's one shot. And your phone died. <laughs> Awkward, right? Yeah, my phone died. So, in my defense... <laughs> I don't know what happened. Honestly, it seems like it was one of those your phone dies and then when you plug it in comes back to life at 20% types of things, but I'm not going to get into that right now. But I still wanted to share this video with you. It's pretty much done anyway. Daryl was just about to go into a breakdown, but you got to see the shot. You got to see my my um my onesie. <laughs> got to see our messy room don't judge us we just were literally about to do it and daryl was like you know what we should record and you know now i'm very glad that he did <laughs> 
so um like i said i just finished editing the egg retrieval video i'm super excited to share that with you guys um so you'll probably see that within the next few days um just make sure you guys are subscribed make sure you hit that little bell button so that way you can get a notification when it's posted and when the videos after that are posted but um just remember y'all god is good all the time and all the time god is good <laughs> But um, just remember y'all, God is good all the time, and all the time God is good, and Lord willing, I will see y'all next time.